what is that hey fools welcome back to another video in today's video y'all i'll be trying pho for the first time when i tell y'all i am so excited to try this y'all have no idea now this is my did i say for the first time yeah this is my first time trying pho y'all so i'm excited so let me tell y'all everything i got in here so i believe i have come on phone unlock so I have um, steak in here, brisket, fatty flank, crunchy flank, tendon, tripe, and meatballs, y'all. And then it's topped with red onions, cilantro, green onions, and I think this is uh, sweet onions in here too. And then I have some bean sprouts, some um, basil, jalapenos. Don't talk about the way I say jalapenos, okay? But I have some of that. I have some hoisin sauce, some sriracha sauce. And I have some limes. I don't, they only give me one lime. Fresh spring rose. I think that's called a peanut sauce. I'm not sure. And then this is the um, Vietnamese fried, uh, fried, what did I get? Is it fried egg roll? Hold on, y'all. <laughs> yeah, fried egg roll. Oh, and this is a, a he pronounced it taro. Taro smoothie. So y'all, they actually for, forgot to give my DoorDasher the um, the taro smoothie. And I called up there and I was like, oh my God, I really wanted to try the taro smoothie. He was like, oh no, no, it's okay. Um, I'll bring it to you. And I'm like, you gonna bring it to me? He was like, yeah, send me, let me know your address. So I let him know my address. And y'all, I did not think this man was gonna come <laughs> because it's like 30 minutes from their restaurant to my house. And I definitely tipped that man $20, okay? Um, so yeah, so that was so freaking nice, y'all. All right, I'm so excited. So, okay. Now I was trying to watch some videos on how to, how to actually eat this. It's still hot, ooh, yes. So I know I'm supposed to mix all this around, right? Right, let me know down below. Let me know if I'm doing something wrong. <laughs> Teach me, okay? Teach me. Mix it on up. Go some meat, y'all. I got a lot of meat. I really do. I think I told y'all everything I got in there. And then I think I'm supposed to add these Brussels sprouts. I mean bean sprouts. So I'm gonna add a little bit of that. I'm gonna add some basil. I think this basil. <laughs> it looked like basil. So I'm gonna add some of these. I just like how it's so fresh. You know, like fresh ingredients and stuff. Like, I'm gonna add some jalapenos. Let me go ahead and taste it first. One of my pools told me not to get the rice noodles, noodles, but because they said it was really slippery. Y'all, I'm not boosting. Oh my God. This it. I'm forever hooked on pho. Oh my God. This is just too good. I also wanted to wanted this to cool down some because I, you know, sometimes if it's stuff something is too hot, you can't really, you know, taste it for real, for real. That broth go crazy. This beef broth, it go crazy. Yes. Mmm. Jalapeno. <clears throat> I love all the freshness to this. It's so fresh and warm. You know, like this is just a warm dish. I actually seen, cause I was looking up a little bit, you know, I ain't got that much time cause I really have to get this video up. It's literally, it's 
Let me see. What time I'm filming this? It's literally 3.04 right now. Then my kids, y'all see them? But it's literally 3.04 right now and I gotta get this video up by five o'clock. Um, so we don't know. Today is Friday. Oh my goodness. Hopefully I can get this up today. I told y'all I was gonna be uploading every single day. I want everybody to try this. Everybody. One of my pools said she made some at home. I forgot her name. It's like two, two hood, two hood something. I don't know. <laughs> I'm sorry, girl. Cause you comment all the time. You show me too much love for me not to remember your full name on there. <laughs> Look at this big piece of meat. Hold on now. We got to get some more noodles with that. Some tripe and some basil and a jalapeno pepper i got jalapeno pepper on there too y'all can't see it but i can't show y'all <laughs> mm. telling you mm. so I actually seen oh I was telling y'all something so this is what I was telling y'all I actually seen somewhere so this guy he's Vietnamese and he was saying like before you even start throwing sriracha sauce and hoisin sauce inside of here taste it first because a lot of times you don't even need that he do sometimes take his meat. Hold on, hold on. He said he do um, sometimes take his meat and he'll dip it on the side. I said, well, okay, sir, teach me some. What is that? Y'all, this tastes so good. Hold on, I gotta taste that by itself. Ooh, it's like sweet. I don't know. I don't know how to do. Ooh, that is delicious. Mixed in with that sriracha sauce. Oh, that go crazy. Y'all, I am so in love right now. Like, honestly, I am just so in love. I'm gonna tell you. I know this a lot, but... I'm telling you, I could low-key finish this and my stomach shrunk, okay? Ever since I lost 60 pounds, y'all, I can't eat that much, but hey, I'm telling you, I can finish this. Stop playing with me. Oh, they got a customer for life with me. Oh my God, this is one of those things where I cannot explain the flavor. I cannot explain, it's milky for sure. I cannot explain this. Hold on now, what's in this? I'm gonna have to look this up because that is really, really good. Taro smoothie is a quick and easy drink recipe that is made with a sweet, and delicious blend of taro root, soy milk, maple syrup, iced vanilla extract, and tapioca pearls. Remember I told y'all that I was supposed to have, um, I don't know if I said that, but I was supposed to have some um, tapio tapioca in, at the bottom, but um, he forgot it, but I'm grateful, okay? Um, but wow, okay. Honestly, I never even heard of uh, taro root. I'm telling you, you just learn so much. Okay, let me get into this fresh, what is this? Fresh spring roll. Yeah, this is a fresh spring roll. I see people eating this, y'all, and I'll be like, oh my God, I want to try it so bad because it just looks so fresh and just delicious. <laughs> so it looked like it's some basil, on, basil in here and these, um, the rice noodles and some shrimp. And this is 
peanut sauce. Let's see. Oh, dang. I should have tried it without the peanut sauce first. Oh, you know what? I'm biting on the other end. Oh. Little fishy. Love the di different textures. Mmm. Okay, let's try with the peanut sauce. That took this. This was already like a like a seven for me because of the freshness and the different textures, and I love that. But to dip that in here, I know y'all thinking I'm being really dramatic right now, but I'm not. I promise you that. I want Aiden to try this. My oldest, he don't like nothing like this. <laughs> I can sit and eat this all of it. Mm -mm. That is just too good. Mmm, I found the meatball. It's so much meat in here too. Hold on y'all. Let's try this. Somehow I know how to eat, uh, I know how to use chopsticks today, huh? <laughs> if you ain't watched my last video, go watch my last video. Man, it's wasting sauce. Stop playing mixed with the sriracha. Mmm. Delicious. Mmm. I would have never thought that I would eat tripe. I'm going to tell you that now. But I'm stepping outside. And when you step outside, you open your palate to something amazing. Okay? I mean, just try different foods. I didn't grow up eating anything like this. I grew up only on soul food, y'all. Only on soul food. I don't think I've ever ate anything else. I, well, I'm sorry. Mexican food. <laughs> mm. It's a good day. A really good day. Oh my God. Mm -mm -mm. Mm. Smells a bit vinegary. I don't know. You smell a little vinegary, but a little tad bit sweet. Mm. Damn. Mm mm mm. Mm. Let's add some more. This gonna be a long video. Either you're gonna stay with me or you're not. <laughs> because I'm staying. <laughs> this is too good. I can't believe. I can't believe. Y'all been holding out on me. Okay? Why ain't nobody ever suggested me to try for? I don't understand. I've been on YouTube for too long. I guess y'all say, well, girl, you only ate uh, seafood. <laughs> you right. One of my foods told me to use a lot of lime, but I'm so glad that I tasted this without the lime first. So let's try it. Let's try it. Can y'all tell I'm happy? And one of my pools told me, she was like, you got to go to the right place because sometimes people don't, you know, do the authentic pho. And, um... And that kind of scared me a little bit because I'm like, dang, I hope I go to a good spot. But every time I pass that that uh, fur place, it be, it be jumping. I mean, jumping, jumping. Mm-mm-mm. Man, that's good. I want somebody to... 
sit here and eat with me. You know, I love when food just so good. You just want to share. Man, this is definitely that dish. I definitely want to share this. Share this with somebody. Mm, mm, mm. I'm really hoping I can get this video up today because mm. I can really sit here and just mm, mm, mm. Hmm. and they ain't stingy with they meat. Mm. And it's not really heavy either. I don't know if because the noodles are so thin. Mm. I don't know y'all probably like this girl is so dramatic, but I'm telling you, if you don't love her like this, then the place you went to is straight ass. I'm gonna tell you that right now. Mm-hmm. I'm telling you, you need to check somebody else out. Go to a whole nother fuck place. Mm. Wow. Can I tell y'all something? Mm. This peanut sauce. I don't know why I thought this was going to taste really peanut-y. <laughs> You know, like, I don't know why I thought it was going to be like, it'll hit you with peanut, like a lot of peanut flavor, but honestly, it doesn't really taste like, yeah, it's not really giving me peanut. It's just giving me, let me see. Mm. Yeah. I don't know what it's giving me, but it's giving me amazing. See, the problem is when you eat, like you get introduced to like new cuisines and things like that, it's kind of hard for you to explain it um, for your first time. But like over time, I feel like if you eat it enough, you'll be able to explain it to people on what things taste like. But I was like that with Filipino food. I just could not explain the flavor of stuff because it was just something I've never had before. Wow. Damn, I'm telling y'all, there's so much meat in here. Everything is at the bottom. <sighs> what a bite this about to be. Mm, mm, mm. Mm. I know it just looked like a simple dish, but ain't nothing simple about this. Nothing. Everything was delicious. Eat that with that. What are you eating? It's pho. Oh, pho? Mm hmm. Oh, yeah, I heard of it. Mm hmm. I watched his YouTube video. It was, um, your name was Zach and T. Zach and T. Mm -hmm. I think I know who you're talking about. This is good. It's good? How you like the sauce? It tastes like... I don't know. <laughs> it tastes like... I don't know. That's what I said. It's, some, it's something you can't explain, right? Yeah. It is. It's something you can't explain. That's a Vietnamese egg roll. Try this drink. I'll take that. Try that drink. What do you think of the drink? It tastes like a weird chocolate milkshake. Or like cookies. <laughs> it tastes like a, a weird cookies and cream milkshake. Weird? Mm -hmm. You don't like it? I do. It's just like different. It's different, yeah. 